Hello my friends, I'm Professor Hans von Puppet. Today we'll be taking a look at a Euro-inspired area enclosure worker placement bluffing game, which is heavy on downtime, but still gateway-ish and simple. Hello. Bluffing in games. It's one of my more favorite uh, things in games. Uh, bluffing in games means that the game is designed for you to bluff, so it's okay to lie, it's okay to uh, be sneaky and make agreements and not keeping those agreements. But it's not okay to cheat. That is a totally different thing. But bluffing is a great concept. Uh, so take this map for instance, uh, from no particular game at all. And we have these guys here, uh, let's call them sparks, against these, uh, I don't know, canisters. And uh, yeah, do you want to uh, raid Red here? And uh, the canisters say, sure, I'll raid them. And uh, then you reveal the orders and something entirely different happens, yeah. Sparks, sparks, they move in and take over the control of the black ones. And yeah, that's a great bluffing game. And another pure bluffing game is Skulls, where you just uh, put down some simple pieces on the board and you announce how many you think you have or the others have, and yeah, you can bluff by, by betting on your own even though you have a skull underneath. So bluffing where lying and deal breaking is done it's a great concept in games, especially if done right. If done wrong, though, be wary, because this can really ruin friendships, actually. Okay, that's bluffing. Well, I hope that cleared things up for you. Until next time, have fun gaming.